Hello Lancers! In this video, I'm going to show you how I silk the elastics on my brand new Russian point, point shoes. So stay tuned! Hello dancers! Welcome back to the Love Ballerina! I hope you're safe, I hope you're healthy, and I hope that you're following the guidelines to stop the spread of the coronavirus. My mission with this channel is to support your journey by providing you tutorials, how-tos, and sharing my own journey with you as an adult ballet dancer. The different thing about this video is going to be that I actually had the opportunity to film the entire process of showing the, of sewing showing showing you how I sewed the elastics from a bird's eye view. I put the shoes in a light box and then I was able to make it look pretty nice. So I'm going to narrate over that part once we start. One thing I wanted to tell you guys is that I have not been really putting the ribbons on my point shoes because since I'm only using them for practice and not for performance, um, I just don't feel like spending the extra time putting the, the ribbons on. But um, if that's something that you want to do, I have another video where I had my adobo students sewing the first pair. I'll link it below. So in that part, we actually did elastics and ribbons. So if you want to check that out, it's going to be below but this time i just i got a new pair of shoes um because i figured out this is like right before the outbreak i realized that everything's probably going to be closed for a while so i got a new pair and i finally got around to sewing the elastics and this time i did them i just wanted to try something different i usually sew them on the outside so it doesn't bother the inside of my foot but this time I sewed them on the inside and as you can see they look really nice and I tried them on and it really doesn't bother me and sewing the elastics and the ribbons on your point shoes is always going to be somewhat of a personal preference for people different people try and like different things but you know like I said I'm still evolving my method as well and this is actually a different shoe. This is the Rubin from Russian Point. Before that, I had the Rubin Radiance, which has this part made of suede, which I really love, but they didn't, I couldn't find it. So um, this one is still nice because it doesn't have the pleats down here. So it's a really pretty shoe. And um, I'll post a video where I actually dance in them. I still haven't really danced in them, but I will definitely post that. So here we go, enjoy the part where I actually go through the bird's eye view tutorial. And if there is any other kind of point shoe related videos you would like me to make, please let me know.
this is the kind of content that you would like to see, please make sure to hit the subscribe button, the notification bell, so you know when I post a new video, which these days with what's going on is quite often. And also leave me a comment. And if you like this video or any other of my videos, please make sure to give it a like and share it with whoever you think will also get value from it.